All right, so this video in particular is actually going to show you how to fillet a fluke. What you're going to want to do is get behind this fin right here and make a slit down this way and come down next to the stomach just like that. Make, the, make sure it's all the way. Now, with fluke, it's different. Their spine is right in the middle. So you got to literally... Just like that. Okay. Now the thing with this is you gotta get under it with a knife, bend that knife a bit, keep that knife bent, and just skim downwards. See? Make sure you don't slice yourself. Uh, there are people that can do this in like five minutes and there's people like me that like to get every inch of meat off of it like I said every inch of meat One piece right there. Same thing on this side, but you're gonna do it the opposite way, depending on if you're a righty or a lefty. Same thing on the other side. Yes, a lot of people like to throw this away. This is actually great bait and has meat. So, don't throw it away. And if you're gonna use this for bait, make sure you keep the carcass with you. This way if game warden comes, you have proof that it's a legal sized fish, otherwise you'll get a ticket. Seems for some reason that uh, fluke are carnivores. I hit that at the wrong angle with this knife right now, but we'll make it work. Drop my rod. This wind is it's not playing today. There's some bones over here, this little rib cage over there. You're gonna have to sneak by it.
doing this in a bit of a rush so that it's not a long video. This fleshy part right here, if you can't get it, don't worry about it. It's only where it's ribs sit. See, I missed a chunk of meat over here. Oh well. But if you do it right, you should have, you could be able, you should be able to see through it. Now when you're skinning it, here's what you want to do. You want to cut a small piece on the end and angle the knife downwards. And just pull with the skin. Just keep going. Yeah, I messed this whole fluke up. It's all right, that one I'll use for bait. I already have a lot of fluke at home anyway. Again, slide it back here. Hold it with your finger. If you can, if it was a little bit bigger, I'd be able to slide it back better. Keep that knife downwards. Now you can grab the skin, keep that knife, and pull. This is the most, this meat is right here. This is where you're gonna get the most meat, right here. So, I got more room here. course and now it's becoming slippery you should it's best to do this on a piece of wood but make sure if you're gonna do it on a bulkhead like this like me ghetto make sure it's dry see how I missed no meat on that beautiful meat right there All right, you're just gonna do the same thing on the other side as well. I mean, on this side. Yeah, definitely make sure it's dry. Once you get this filleted, put it directly on ice. I do not have ice on me, but it'll do. That we can throw, that we can throw. This will keep, and this will keep, and this will keep, so that we can use it for bait. 